Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So in this video today, I'm gonna show you how to check and change the ocean regions and the nav areas on the Immersat Sea. Well, as you know that, this is very important task for the officers because for some reasons, if you don't know how to set up that properly, you will unable to receive the warning message from that area and you will also get a bit trouble during PSC inspection. That's why in this video now, I will show you how to set up that properly. Okay, so let me get straight into it. Well, as you can see that, this is a Pruno Imasasi. So firstly, I will show you the publication where you find and uh, check the ocean regions and the nav areas. And then I will show you how to set up for that. Okay. So right now, I'll show you how to check and select that on the Admiralty Digital Publications 1345. Well, you know, after this, you can also check and select the ocean regions and the nav area in some other paper publications as well, like ZMD LS Manual or International Safety Net Service Manual. Okay? So now I will try to show you how to find and check that on the ADP. Well, as you can see that this is the ADP 1345. To open that, you just uh, double click on that icon. And when this screen appear, you click on the reference on the taskbar here. Then you select the my time safety information. So you can see that, right? So now you can select the nav areas and met areas here. You can see that here I have all information here. So as you can see, this is the Imasasi coverage for ocean regions and the nav areas. So they are for ocean regions. It marks in different sign and different color. So the first one is the Atlantic Ocean region west. You can see this is the Atlantic Ocean region west. I move the cursor so that you can see that more clearly. You see that, right? And the second one, Atlantic Ocean Region East. You can see here, this is the, the small dot here. And the third one, India Ocean Regions, is marked in the pink color. You can see that, right? This one, the India Ocean Regions. And the last one, Pacific Ocean Region, this one. And here as well. And the next one is the NAF area and the MET area. So you can see there are 21 NAF area and MET area from number one to number 21. So when the vessel stay anywhere on this map, you need to change and select the appropriate ocean regions and the nav area. So for example, if the vessel stays somewhere in Vietnam, you can see in Vietnam right here. So you have to select the Pacific Ocean regions, this one, and the, the MET and nav area number 11. Okay. And another example, if the vessel stay in the in the in the Red Sea right here, so you need to select the India Ocean regions and the nav area is uh, number nine, Pakistan. 
Okay. So you know, currently Alvenso is still in the uh, east coast of United States. That's why I will select the ocean regions east or west because you can see this one. We stay right here. That's why it cover the ocean region west and ocean regions east. Okay, and also the nav and the mat area is the four. Okay, so that now we I will get back to the Imbasasi so that I will show you how to change this one. So firstly, I will show you how to set up the ocean regions, and then I will show you how to change the nav and mat areas. Okay, so to change. The ocean regions you press on the f7 keyboard options then you move the arrow to number six ocean region then you press enter so just like what i mentioned before there are four ocean regions the first one west atlantic ocean region the second one east atlantic ocean regions third one pacific ocean regions and the last one, Indian Ocean Reason. And you also have another option, it's auto, but I've never used that before. Because every time when I change the Ocean Reason, I change by manual, okay? And just like what I told you before, currently we are in uh, the East Coast of United States. That's why the, I can select the East or West Atlantic Ocean region, right? So, you see, currently we are setting Atlantic Ocean region it east. So now I will try to change that to the west. Okay, so you move arrow to the ocean region which you want to select. So I will try to select West Atlantic Ocean region. Then you press Enter. Then you press Yes. So this progress will take for a while. You just wait until that finish. So when it's finished, it will appear the successful, you know, message on the screen of the Imasasi. As you can see that successful login. Atlantic Ocean Region West. Okay. So now I will show you how to change for the NAF area. To change for the NAF area, you press on the F8 keyboard setup. Then you move the arrow to number four, Easy C setup. Then you press enter. As you can see this one. This is nav area and mat area. So just like what I mentioned before, our current nav and mat area is number four. That's why you can see it here. So if you want to change that, you press enter and you can change every enough area here, like uh, number five, or number zero six. You can see, if you can delete, you delete, you can delete that as well. So for example, number four, and uh, number 11. You can see, then you press enter, Just like that. Oh, and another one I almost forgot to tell you. So when the vessel stay in the Australian coastal or in some other part of America, so you need to change for the coastal warming area. So, so let's go back to the computer. I will show you how to get that, okay?
So to check the navigation coastal area warming areas, you press on the view. Then you select the NAV area, MAT area, right there. You can see that, right? Let me view and show NAV areas and MAT area. And you can see this one, Australia, Australian water. As you can see this is the coastal warming area from A to 8. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, 8. So it eventually stay anywhere on this uh, coastal warming area. You have to change the station to this one, okay? And for another example, when you stay in uh, America, South America, you can see, so you also have to change the station here, A, B, C, D, E, F. So do not forget, you know, do not forget to change this one, this one very important one. If you don't know how to change that, you will, you know, get a bit trouble during PSC inspection, okay? So, let's go back to the Imasasi. So, for example, if you want to change the coastal warming area, you press enter, then you can write the code A, B, C, whatever you like, okay? Just like that. A, B, or 8. Then, to fin finish that, you press enter. Then, so, so you press on the ESC. If you want to save that, so you click on the, you know, yes. So just like that. And uh, every time when you change for the ocean regions, and the NAV and MES area, you have to record that into ZME LS logbook, okay? Okay, everyone, that's all for me. Thank you very much for the watching. So I hope this video is helpful for you. And if you want to see more video, please don't forget to like and subscribe my channel. Thank you, and I'll see you in next video. Bye-bye.